before you start, make sure you have the Wi-Fi dongle plugged into the inverter, your Wi-Fi network name and password, a smartphone with the Solus Cloud app installed, either iOS or Android, physical access to the inverter, and a mobile device with internet access. How to reconnect the Wi-Fi dongle. Step one, make sure there is power to the inverter. Ensure the inverter is powered on and the Wi-Fi dongle is securely connected. The dongle will often have an LED. A green light blinking equals not connected. A solid green light equals connected. Step two, reset the Wi-Fi dongle. Open your Solus Cloud app. Select service. Select Wi-Fi configuration. Manually enter serial number or use scanner to scan the QR code. Select next. Select browser configuration. Press and hold the reset button on the dongle for 10 to 20 seconds until the LED begins flashing rapidly. This puts the dongle into configuration mode. You may hear a beep depending on the model. Select I'm sure it is flashing. Step three, connect your phone to the dongle's Wi-Fi. Go to your phone's Wi-Fi settings. Look for a network like this. Connect to this network by entering the password 123456789. You may be prompted for login. Enter username ADMIN, password ADMIN123. Select login. Step four, enter your Wi-Fi details. Select Wi-Fi. Select your home Wi-Fi network from the list. Enter your Wi-Fi password. Select next. Select OK. Step six, check dongle connection. After saving, the dongle will disconnect from your phone and try to connect to your home Wi-Fi. The green LED should change from blinking to solid if the connection is successful. After saving, wait a few minutes to allow the data logger to establish a connection. Step seven, confirm on Solus Cloud app. Open the Solus Cloud app. Check if your inverter is online. If not, try refreshing the page or checking signal strength. Troubleshooting tips. If the Wi-Fi SSID doesn't appear, try rebooting the inverter. Make sure your 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi band is active. Dongles do not support the five gigahertz. Keep your phone close to the inverter during setup. If you have a mesh system, try connecting to the primary node or router. If you are still experiencing problems, please contact Activate Customer Support for assistance.